Okay, Houston, right. we've had a problem here. This is Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey Houston, again, we want to continue our conversation about weathering, but now we want to talk about how fast do things weather and how do you, what factors affect how fast something weathers. So the rates of weathering are determined by three key ingredients. The characteristics of the rock, the rock characteristics, the climate in which the weathering is occurring, and something cool called differential weathering. So let's talk about each of these in turn. So rock characteristics. So if the rock is a type of rock that breaks down more readily, chemically, or whatever, then that makes a difference. So the mineral composition of the rock and its, uh, its, its uh, uh, parent minerals uh, makes a difference. So, and then if you end up having like cracks and joints, then that's going to cause it to uh, weather more rapidly. Obviously, if it doesn't have these, then it will weather more slowly. Now, remember that everything weathers. It's just a matter of how fast, but some rocks will weather more rapidly than others. So the characteristic of the rock makes a huge difference. So here's a classic example. Here we have two, uh, uh, what you call it, uh, headstones. And I don't know if you catch this, but they started in the same year, 1939. So they were erected somewhere around 1939. First, this is 1939. And by the way, they keep adding this to so the family Norris or whatever. This one looks awesome, and this one doesn't. Because this one here is made of granite. And this one here is made of uh, marble. And marble, it turns out, is more susceptible to, to acid rain than granite is. And so because the nature of this rock is that it is affected by acid rain, it's deteriorated significantly, where this one's still looking good many, many years later. So that makes a huge difference there. The second thing that's going to affect it is climate. And it turns out that ultimately the key is, is the warmer, lusher the climate, the faster things break down because the biologic activity can happen. And if it's a dry, arid climate, the less it will be. So the nature of the climate makes a classic difference. Here's an interesting story and a sad story. This is um, an obelisk that was in Egypt and it had sat, stayed in Egypt for several thousand years. Okay, and you can see how organized and how pretty it is. They said, uh, then somebody said, oh, we want to move it to New York. So they brought it to New York, a warmer, moist, well, it wasn't warmer, but a moister climate. This is dry, dry, key, it's just dry. And this is a moist climate, and it began to deteriorate this, this amazing Egyptian artifact. And for thousands of years, it looked like this, and they brought it to uh, New York, and they, yeah, it didn't, it wasn't a good thing. <laughs> And then there's other last one we want to talk about, a thing called differential weathering. So it turns out some rocks are harder than others. Makes sense, right? And the rocks that are harder will weather slower. So in the case of arches, this is a classic, you know, Arches National Park and stuff like that in uh, Utah, is these arches, is, is that, that there was weaker rock in between here and on the outside here, and this all weathered away, but the hardest rocks remain. And then they, they often will make these really cool shapes. Again, here's a kind of a desert. So these were harder rocks right here. And all the rocks around here that filled this whole valley have all eroded away. And it's left the cool shapes of the hardest rocks available. And that's called differential weathering because some they're weathering at different rates. So there you have it. They're affected by different rates, and, and sometimes the rates, you might ask the question, how fast do they weather? It really depends on, on the different factors. Some, they will you know, be a few you know, years. Some even could you know, break down in months and weeks, and uh, some thousands and thousands and millions of years. So it depends on uh, those factors that make a difference. You guys got this. We'll see you in class.